it's Mona here at Craft Clutch. Today is Friday, that means it's another Coaster Friday. In the past we've made some food coasters, we've made eggs, we've made a hamburger, which has multiple coasters associated with it, each layer, and we've done s'mores, and we did a pizza. Today we're going to do chocolate chip cookie coasters. We're making chocolate chip cookie coasters, and I have some polymer clay here, and this one is latte. And this is probably even going to be easier than baking regular cookies. Now all I need to do is condition it, which means just kneading it until it's soft. All right, now I'm going to roll it into a ball once I got it soft enough. Okay, just like that. And now I'm just going to start squishing it down. Now remember, chocolate chip cookies are not completely flat. So you're going to want to have some lumps and stuff in there, but not enough to make your cup unstable on it. Okay, and it looks like that'll do it. So now I'm going to take this burnt umber clay, and I'm just going to take little tiny pieces. Okay, just little tiny, teeny, tiny pieces. Roll them into little balls and squish it on there until it's flat. All right, so now here it is so far. I'm going to carefully lift it up, put it on my pan. Now I think it needs a little bit of texture, which will get away from the um, fingerprints that are on there. And I'm just using a stencil brush. I'm just going to wipe a little bit of texture off of the chocolate chips. I've taken these pastels, and I took the dark brown and this orangey color, and I shaved it off into a little bowl, mixed it up, and I'm just taking a brush. I'm just going to go kind of around the edges to make it look like it's been baked. And then you can pop it in the oven or you can make more. Here are our cookies all finished and cooled off from the oven. And they have a nice little baked look to them. And if you get a candlestick and a little candle plate from the dollar store, um, you can glue them together. And then you can have them on display on your side table and it looks like a little plate of cookies. These are great for kids too, if you're having a hard time getting them to use coasters. Um, this might just add enough fun for them to want to use them. So here it is, it fits right on that one. This is my smallest one and yet it still fits. And then here's another one. So be sure to let me know what you think of the chocolate chip cookie coasters in the comments below. I hope you guys like the cookie coasters. Um, they were fun to make, really easy, and I think you ought to give them a try. If you guys make the chocolate chip cookie coasters or any of the coasters that I make, I would love to see them. Be sure to tag me. Um, you can post them on Facebook, Instagram, um, Twitter, and I will see them and use the hashtag Another Coaster Friday. So thanks guys so much for watching. I will definitely see you next time. If you haven't yet, be sure to subscribe so you don't miss a thing. And remember, life is too short not to shimmer, so grab your glue gun and your glitter. Stay safe. Bye guys.